Welcome back to these unfortunate ones, among which I count myself for having uh, fallen to my death and injury so many times already. Right, so here is Spicedead Park. That's also the gate control, no doubt. What have we got? In memory of this district's founder, Cornelius Thaddeus Dillsborough, may the builder let his soul rest. You know what? Let's close the gate in case uh, anybody on the street gets suspicious. Welcome to Spicedead. This park was created to commemorate the founding of the Spicedead district of the city. As the name suggests, the district is named after the large rock spire that can be seen in this park. Rockspire has served as a landmark around which this district has been built. I guess that's a model of the spire. From time immemorial, many different species of paleless amphibians could be found in this area. On display here, one can examine an egg from one of these characteristic animals. Okay, so we've got one, two... We've got definitely got four torches that are illuminating the park proper. Maybe those two, maybe those two don't count. I mean, that's my problem. Beyond this gate lies the great rock spire around which the city's district of Spirestead has been built. Due to the rock's instability and the potential danger this poses to visitors, the portion of the park that lies behind this gate is closed. Shame. Well, let me try something here with this egg. <laughs> okay. Waste of a broadhead, but that barely matters. Alright, I'm going to try four then. Four for the number of torches, which I didn't try. That's not a four, that's a four. So I put it as two, six, four, zero. Maybe that's the right answer. There we go, there we go, look at that money. Book. Request from Digging Crew concerning Project 339 Sewerage System Underground Expansion. We request that the newer section of the sewers, where we have been digging to expand the sewerage system beneath our district, be closed off indefinitely. We have uncovered an old stepwell and have dug downward to unveil it in its entirety. By doing so, however, it seems we have disturbed the resting place of some ancient entity. But no, unverified. It seems to be tied to that cursed, cursed relic. Relic found. Curse unknown. Uh, cursed relic we dug up there. We label the current situation as extremely dangerous and we request that the work on expanding the sewerage system be halted until we, or the City Watch, have figured out a way to contain the threat. Request submitted by Foreman Holcomb. Request granted by the City Watch. Door to the new section of the sewers will remain closed indefinitely on account of the area currently possessing significant hazard to workers. Alright, now we have the key. Let's leave them none the wiser. Alright. So those far two torches are not illuminating the park itself. That's the trick. Just for good measure. Okay, well, we should pretty soon be done with those sounds of alarms. So we've been to Gestamezio's. We've been to the apartment building, we've been to the city watch, and we've been to the tavern. We've looted all those places, right? Uh, we've looted the park. We have not been in this park. Can we get in this park? Probably not. So let me just mark on here the, the buildings that we have looted. I don't think it matters. We went to both floors there. We went up here. We went in here. That building was inaccessible. All right, we've been in here, which is the ga the gate. So we've got a few more buildings in the northern area here to explore before we hit the mansion. So that's the plan right now. We can dodge around this alley. Before the metal manhole covers. They're guarding the mansion, that might be the mansion. Yeah, okay. So yeah, we've been in, in this building as well. I 
yes, there's somebody here. There's a guard as well, okay. Might be a nuisance. Well, the guys with swords are going to be a nuisance if they see me up on this ledge, so we have to be a little bit patient here, I guess. Oh, whoever's in that room is uh, walking pretty quickly. Anything you're, you're making it up. There's nobody here. Hmm? Hello, oh, that's all right. Oh, nothing. I'm too tense. Much too tense. All right, that's the little gap between the buildings we saw. And they're guarding something else up there. We got anything here? Nope, just a little, just a little <laughs> hole to get stuck in. My favorite. Moving on these barrels is a little weird. Why am I so brightly lit here? There's windows, maybe. Unfortunately, I want to get over there, and this guy's not going to make it easy. And I've lost my little flash bomb. Hmm. Are the rooftops an option? They don't really look like an option. I mean, it does look kind of like wood on the edge there, but probably not actually, it's probably metal. So you kind of <laughs> lights are very strange in this area. Kind of didn't react for a second. We have a big gap there. Anyway, I had to come here, not just to see if there's any valuables, but there's a banner that needs to die. And there's a couple of open windows, but, uh... Yeah, we're up here. Whose is this place? Surely it's reachable. Any moss here? No. Anything on the statue plaque? It's just an unnamed statue. I'm not going to be able to reach that banner, am I? Damn. Guess you win this one, banner. You win this one. Sure looks like there's places up there I can get to. Hello? Anyone there? No. 
What a ridiculous concept. Oh, quiet now. I'm sure it was nothing. Never anything exciting. Here's another place I could go, which is maybe of interest, but probably not. <laughs> I'm just seeing this as a banner, right? That did not work out. I'm going to have to draw my sword before I get up there. But I think, with a little care, we can... Uh, we can show this banner who's boss. And a bit of luck with the timing of the guards as well, I think. These two are alright, but what about the archer? Well, the archer's not looking in our direction. Probably yeah. worth investigating that. It's probably worth <laughs> investigating, but you're not going to do so, are you? Let's try this again. There we go. Carrot one, banner zero. All right, now we need to get back to the sewers, which is actually, this is the quick way, isn't it? Yeah, all right, we can go to the sewers. And back this way was the door. We have the key now. Been everywhere else, I think that I want to be. Is that visible? Not really. Put it here under the light. That's even less visible. Hmm, that'll have to do. Probably don't need it again, right? William's apartment key I should have left with his apartment. What is the bag of black beans for? Very strange. So this is our old stuff well. Oh. Hmm. Still not look good there, do they? You know what? I'm going to uh, make some less light around here. And as that thing glows. First relic, what's on your objective? This ancient golden relic was surely fetch a pretty penny. Bonus. Okay. That thing does not look like it would be good for me. I want to go where it's coming from. No, I don't. So this does not give me access then. Well that's surprising, who's this? Uh, Mr. Corpse again. So this doesn't get me to uh, Dumont. Okay, I felt was sure that this was going to be access to Dumont. Nice glowy eyes you got, mate. Alright, well let's... Leave you to your business, I think. Having unleashed the terror, let's um maybe we should go back and lock it up again, huh? Maybe that door was locked for a good reason. Who 
You say I could drop the key in there and make sure no one ever finds it again, but you know what? I might want to find it again. It's theoretically possible. I just accidentally left the key there. Alright. Okay, so now we know two different ways into Dumont's. We know... It's the access through... See, that's the thing, the thing is, there's the talk about the basement, right? Uh, the caves connecting to the basement. So I'm a little surprised that did not lead there. But we have our friend in the green build, green brick building. Who was tunneling into the mons over this way. So we can, I think we can just go visit them. And get in that by that means, right? Do we have anything else to do? Not really. We've done all the other stuff. Um, you know what? Sir Williams report, right? Did he talk about the basement or was that something else? Hmm. Maybe a way to get to the caves. So I didn't get to caves, I didn't find caves. I mean, we found this, this, this is clearly a tunnel, not a cave, so this has been dug by hand. Well, maybe we'll find a way into the caves from the basement, and then we'll find how that gets us anywhere. <laughs> Don't worry, there's nobody tapping and grubbers digging holes. Wow, it's bright in this in this area. Okay, he's going back, so that's good news. All right, where are we? We're at the southwest corner of his mansion. So, like, we're like here, right? That's the tunnel. Get on the roof there. Just want to scout around a bit, see what we're, see what we're dealing with. Another moss arrow, that could come in handy. This guy has a long patrol. I guess he's turning around somewhere up here. Yeah, he's coming back. Alright, well we have a we have a apparent way in. I think that must be the servants quarters, right? Hmm, it's really noisy actually. Can't really stand on that. Oh, this is a uh greenhouse. Right, they're not coming in here. Hmm, tasty apples. Is that a healing potion? No. That's a healing fruit, I think. Alright, they're just wandering around the kitchen. You know, you should really have looked at. I am looking at. Who's there? By a doctor. Did, did you say something? No. Nah, it's just a scratch or a laceration or something. Anyways, doctors cost money. Am I right? Search yourself. I'm not scared of doctor, <clears throat> if that's what you're thinking. Of course not.
you know, Benny um, conversation from uh, Thief 3. I don't think I ever really caught m much of it when I played Thief 3, because uh, I only remember seeing it, having other people uh, mention it. You know what, let's... No, let's not do that one. God damn this bloody lip on the thing making it hard to mantle. There's no one here, ma'am. This place gives me the creeps. Back to work. Back to work indeed. I only have two moss. I don't really want to spend <laughs> one on the kitchen, right? The kitchen does not seem like a place to be spending moss. What I do want to do. <gasps> Around that torch. Mm. I can get to the far side of the kitchen without. Well, maybe I can cross over that. Yeah, alright. Well, kind of alright. Not really standing properly here. There we go. Right, bread. Yeah, you got a hit point. All right, this should be basement then. Or is this a wine cellar? Doesn't feel like a wine cellar. Well, this is the wine cellar. I suppose. That's some some good stuff here. Locked with a key, huh? Seems unusual. I wonder what that's about. Sorry, Mr. Rat. This one also locks the key. That is as well. Alright, well, that's curious. I wonder what's going on. Going on. Oh, look at this. Crates I can move? Wow. That's a first for this mission. It's really quite incredible. <laughs> so all the other crates are just not movable, which just makes those ones very weirdly suspicious. I right, guess we're going out that window hole. Successfully, it's a question. Who's there? Oh. <laughs> this room is way too bright for my liking. As is this one, but nobody's in here, so let's hope nobody comes in here. Hello, that's going to be useful. Healing potion, thank you. I'll just take it slow in here, I think. Just trying to avoid making too much noise. Another breath potion. Yes, if you want to stick your head in the bath for long periods of times. Alright, there's a locker in here. Uh, oh, we've got a map. Okay, so let's put K there. Kitchen D, access to basement. Uh, 
Locked door in the basement. Locked doors that need keys. Okay. That looks suspicious to me. Suspiciously like some kind of thing with a, with a lever somewhere to activate it. Private, Jean Dumont. Oh, right. So, private locker. Let's hope I'm not waking anybody up with that clanging. Let's hope that door is doing its job of keeping uh, the sound quiet. I'm guessing it's private locker. Oh, hello. That's nice. I didn't notice the light switch. Guessing his private locker might have the uh... oh, door doesn't open all the way. So I was leaning into it. I was trying to lean out here. I don't know where the guards are. I'm a little leery of just rushing out. Um, straight into the foyer seems a bad idea. All well, there's these side rooms. Hmm. Let's just observe for a little. So she's going to put from the kitchen, I think. There was a guard that came in here and went in those doors. I'm wondering if they come back that way or not. So what was the note? The southern section. Has access to bath, attic and balcony, right. When we're in that area. Right, we've got the locked door. Okay. 2640, that was right. Let's, let's make sure my notes are at least correct. But also, let's, let's stay on the map page that we need, right? So servants coming and going. Just, just a little patience. Is this noisy floor? Yes, it is. Alright, my patience has run out. We'll see if that hurts me or not. Whether that results in me getting caught or not. Hello, guard. These doors are not open all the way either. That's a... Yeah, they're doing that consistently. So what's this power for? Oh, that's great. I'll just, but I wonder if anybody's going to come and turn that back on again. Lights off in the foyer is nice. Are the lights still on in the cloakroom? Any of these code hooks look suspicious? It's a common thing in architects in the city to hide secret passages and... Code hooks. Oh, he's not turning the lights back on either. That's great news for me. Oh, there's the walkways right across the foyer. All right, so if we head. West. Okay, this is a big undisclosed area. It's, it's not seem to have an access way. It does not seem to have a door. Hmm. I'm not sure I'm going to be able to get past that guard. He's just standing there looking the whole time. He's at the front entrance, I probably don't need to get past him. I should guess I should get... Oh, there's a guard the other side as well. Just watching this whole place. Um, you know what I should do then? Oh, there's the guard as well who comes in here. So he comes in here, stands in front of the doors. And then what? Who's this lady? That's not the servant that's all wandering around. Maybe that's one of the guests. There's 
a grate in the ceiling there as well, which is curious. I'm going to try seeing what's up there. Does not look like it opens. <clears throat> Can I not? Ah, but the fence stops here, so I can get up this side. <sighs> okay. Southern section with access to the balcony and aha the undisclosed room has the hammer with some kind of technological protection system Doesn't really look like a mechanist one I thought they said they'd given up all the hammerite stuff but this is definitely telling me otherwise that room is as hammerite as hammerite can be He saw me properly. Oh, there's two of them. All right, well, let's hope they give up in a second, because... Oh, well. The one that actually saw me has given up already. I think the other guy just got... Get back here, you coward! Got alerted by the archer. No, well, you're not just going to stand there, are you, man? That's not... That's not cool. Please tell me this is just part of your patrol. You come here and wait. Oh, man. This could be terrible. I'm out of flash bombs. Oh, no, no. I've got one. Picked one up downstairs. Okay. <coughs> I might have to use it on him. He's not looking this way, actually. So I guess the come out now, whoever you are. The hell? Coward! Face me like a man. How did the archer? How did the archer just get alerted there? Uh, I know, I know, I think I know what's happening, but I think it's just uh. This guy was still searching, and he hit the spot where he's supposed to stand on his patrol and and uh, and stand. And he stood here anyway, thanks to that script. But because he was still in searching mode, he was still broadcasting his alert status to this other guard who picked it up. Is what I think happened. Made for a little bit of a weird weirdness, but it's fine. Can't see a thing in here. Do we have lights? We do. All right. Dear Adelise, I was glad to hear you are doing well. Your father can be a pig-headed man when he is occupied with his business endeavours. I'm well aware that that's something that takes a lot of time and effort, but I also know that it can take its toll on the atmosphere in the house. I was therefore so glad to hear that your parents have both agreed to you coming to stay with me for a few weeks. Some time in the fresh country air will do you good. I must say I've definitely not missed the thick and musty air of the city one bit since I moved. What I do miss, there was always a baker or a butcher around the corner. Now I have to travel quite a ways before I can get my groceries. But I digress. I miss you and I look forward to having you come stay with me. See you soon. Love, Grandma. Nothing. Mirrors. Some jewellery, alright. Well, that's worth having. These doors just do not open all the way. Fortunately, that's a uh, bad habit that is uh, taught to new mappers sometimes. 
to avoid the door clipping through the wall problem, which is... There's better ways of dealing with it than Don't leaving a door blocking half the doorway. Who's been here? What the fuck? Should have taken the opportunity before he turned the lights on. I should have known he would turn the lights on. Wow, okay, these guards are not messing about, and that's going to be annoying. They encouraged me to blackjack them all early and often rather than avoid them, which is not my preference, honestly. If we're going to keep getting interrupts and lights turned on, that's going to be. Like he saw the door was open and came. Oh, was that something there? <gasps> no, it's just the texture on the back wall. Okay. Um. So look, these doors have absolutely no reason not to open the full 90 degrees. <sighs> so it seems to have been applied to every door just to not open all the way. Because occasionally when you put a door in tight geometry, it's a problem. Oh well. Are these banners choppable? No. Okay, where are we? South side. Um, first floor, south. Box door. Needing a key, obviously. Don't stand there. Miss, please go about your servantly duties elsewhere. Very nice banner, actually. That's right. Ah, oh, this is the main stairway. This will take us back to the foyer, right? No. Sitting room. Captain Leoric, it has come to my attention that some of the guards do not use the sitting room on the first floor. We have set up this room specifically so that the guards can rest while also still being able to keep an eye on things should that be required. It has also come to my attention that instead of using our sitting room, the guards seem to find it necessary to indulge in certain alcoholic refreshments on our balcony and cause the inevitable noise and nuisance, especially for the guards who are actually on duty at that time. So this is my final warning to you. Urge your guards to use our sitting room for the intermediate breaks instead of our balcony, so that we can better control what these brutes are up to in their spare time. I trust to, infor to have informed you adequately. Lady Jacqueline. Ah, Lady Jacqueline must be who we saw uh, wandering the way there. Hello, apples. I'll have that, thank you. Do I still have my cheese? I do. And a bread of cursed relic. And a deer leg. Well, the deer leg was not cursed. That was tasty. Right. And this crosses from the southern section. Uh, from the west to the east to the southern section. Which I kind of want to check out. But I also want to check out the balcony. You know what? Let's come back to the balcony. I think we should have an opportunity to cross over here in a minute. Oh, are we going around in circles now? Yes, we are. All right. Well, back to the balcony then. Is that something? Is that something at the statue? No. Guess it's nothing now. All right, back to the balcony. Ah, oh, so let's go with this sword. Maybe he was out here carousing. That would explain it. I only had reached that light switch sooner, but the door was in the way. The guard was coming. Oh well.
Oh, there's a break in the fence there. So that might have been another way in. Interesting. Just right there. Banners. I see, yeah, the guard was the, the guard of the sword has been hanging out here, drinking like he's not supposed to do up here. They're incorrigible, these guys. Can't courage them one bit. Any other dropped valuable drinks? No. Alright, and this brings me back this brings me over to the northern section. Just Garrett failing. Wow, he's got super well. Just Garrett failing a mantle. Nothing to worry about. <laughs> Believe you'll give it up in just one second. Okay. Whose room is this? Sure, why this dramatic music, uh, dramatic sound effects all of a sudden? Hello? Cushions. Is there something under the pillows? No. Alright, just a uh, thingy me, a wardrobe thingy me there. Hello, what's this? Lord Jean, friend of the Order of the Hammerites. Regarding our earlier correspondence, I write to thee concerning thy service concerning service in thy personal guard. Several inmates from Crags cleft doth we pick by hand for thee to consider for employment as guard. These bums, ruffians, and vagabonds are currently eligible for penalty relief for serving time within Crags Cleft and displaying relatively good behaviour therein. We are dwelling after thou hast conducted the necessary conferences and arrangements to have them work for thee on a probationary period. Thou art entitled to early dismissal of their services without notice, if their commitment doth not pertain to thy standards. Attached to this letter thou canst find a concise overview of the profiles of several of our inmates. We will be in touch shortly regarding thy preferences herein. Sincere regards, Brother Winbrand, Priest of the Hammerite Order. Right, well he's definitely still... There's another one here as well. Still, uh... <sighs> Completely next to the hammerites, despite his protestations. So there's very dramatic music when I enter, uh, dramatic sound when I entered this room, but I don't know why. Lord Jean, you asked us to report directly to you rather than to the captain, hence this letter. We done caught and intercepted a low life churl in the act while he was digging a tunnel to your estate. One of us kept an eye on him from the street, so he was never able to finish his plan. Don't you worry, we took care of him and his tunnel. We also done roughed up the servant who spilled your soup the other day. He sure learned his lesson. He called in sick earlier this week and we haven't seen him since. Unfortunately, we never did find that silverware that went missing. That's tough luck. If you have any other particular requests, let us know. Silverware went missing, huh? Servant spilled the soup. Hmm. What I want from this guy is his keys, but I think it's already wandering downstairs. And maybe, oh no, I see maybe his private locker key would be on his belt, but no, his private locker key is here in his uh, personal bathroom. Why does he have a private locker in the downstairs bathroom? He's got a personal bathroom. I suppose for his convenience, he wouldn't want to have to come upstairs all the time, right? This one's, he'll use this one when he's in his quarters, but certainly he wouldn't. Wouldn't need to uh... maybe wait till the guard's gone since they seem to be suspicious of open doors.
You just gonna sit there all day, man? Oh, you're gonna come back and walk right into me, aren't you? You shouldn't have seen me there. Shouldn't have seen me there, mate. It was dark. Well, I guess it's not dark enough for these candles. Got an alerted somebody else. <sighs> to Jean du Monde, though their words on paper appear venerable and sincere, they are in fact disingenuous and void. It is not merely by expressing the wish to support our order and to follow the true way of the Master Builder that thou canst convince us of thine justful intentions. Thy soul is seen through thy demeanour, not merely by supplicate words. We hereby reject thine earlier request. If it be true, however, that in spite of that thou still wishest to express to us what thine intentions truly are, thou canst display this through thine actions. For instance, rid thee of any relics in thy possession associated with the Hammerite Order. Readeth thou the new scripture of the Master Builder from beginning to end. Rid thee of the ways of stone and brick, and embrace the new and true way of iron and steel. If thou art able to demonstrate the above to us through thine actions, we are prepared to take thy request into reconsideration. The Builder's grace be upon thee, friends of the Mechanist Order. God. Inscriptions of yore and why they are mostly false by Professor H.R. Plimpton. Well, so healing potion has done its job on me. So I've got everybody riled up down here. I'm closing in, Taffer. Does he have a key on him? He does have a key on him. Look at that. Stay awake. I think there's something going on. Are we still in the southern section? No, we're in the northern section now. We'll you soon enough, That's my blood. Ouch. Don't want him getting any DNA evidence from that, right? Alright, we'll take the stairs down. There's, oh, there's apples down there. There's 17 reason to go downstairs. Shit, what a waste. What? It doesn't go out? I thought I missed the first time. It appears it doesn't work. Or did I just miss badly both times? I made that that bad of a taffer. I guess it's possible. I'm not going to waste another torch finding out whether it's my one arrows or not. Alright, we have the private locker key. Did I open that? I did not. It has trolled me. Oh, this is interesting. Alright, there's a safe in his bedroom. We're in the northwestern corner. Uh, first floor, northwest. Maybe that's the key that he keeps on his uh, belt. Can we continue around this house at all? There's a balcony here I should be able to reach, but... <sighs> Having movement problems on very thin edges on that. Let's try this jump. Well, did not work for reasons that are extremely unclear. No, you don't have a lamp. You're not allowed to... Okay. Do you have a purse? That's okay. That's not wood. Well, that window opens. I can't get in that way. So, healing fountain, no, but it is a watery fountain, which I'll have to do. That's the front gate. Alright, well, we're going 
the long way around here. Is that guard at the front gate of anything on the belt? Doesn't. Uh, doesn't appear to. I needn't bother here. No, I mean, that's true. So we have another way in. Oh, another guard with a lamp. What is that bag of black beans for? Why was it hidden in the gas roof? I don't know. He doesn't look like he's got anything on his belt. And we're back here again. Okay. Familiar territory. Slidey roof. So feels like it's a lot slidier than it should be. Can we get over this? Apparently not. Weird. Ah, uh, it's a shame the carrots aren't ripe yet. Okay, kitchen again, huh? At least we know where we are in here. What's that? It's the kitchen door. Who was that there? I saw something. <sighs> Nothing. Okay, hello. We've got uh, something under the stairs here. I didn't imagine we would have accessible plumbing. What happened here? The banner just spontaneously destructed, ma'am. Nothing to do with the garret. Bars. Great. Noisy floor troll chest. You got me. South is the back entrance. Dining room to the east. Guards coming to him from the dining room, okay. Seven water arrows. Who goes there? Hey. God he heard my one tiny tiptoe footstep. Maybe he's maybe he's given up again. Well, everybody's running around. This is the main highway, I think. ourselves away into the back garden, which is actually, we haven't been to this part of the garden before, right? This is new to us. So maybe we'll find something of interest in here. Alright, that is the back garden. Let's check out the side first. Should be not much of garden in this direction. Yeah, it's just a wall. Right, and we've got more garden to explore, but you know what? 
that's going to be next episode. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you then.